Hey guys, and welcome back to our Let's Build a Mountain Settlement Part 3, I repeat, Part 3, The Tavern. So, uh, just clearing out some trees, and I, I wanted to lay out our village before I did any more work, so I'd fill in some roads here. And, um... Uh, yeah, Movie Maker's been giving me some trouble on this one for some reason. Um, the sound wouldn't go in for more than seven seconds, and it didn't want to export and all this crazy stuff. But I got lucky. I got lucky after 20 million tries. But, um, so on this building, there's going, I wanted it to be like an old medieval style tavern slash inn, and I figured we could put the tavern as kind of a basement level and also build it into the side of this mountain, and I wanted it to feel like it was built into the side of the mountain, so it's kind of rocky and rugged in there. And now, I was actually at Walmart grocery shopping with my mom earlier, and um... I went to the McDonald's in the Walmart for lunch, and so I got my food, and they had a little seating area, so I went to go sit down in it, and there was a guy sitting there, so I left a gap of one chair in between him and me, give him his personal space, you know. So I'm sitting there eating my burger with uh, mind my own personal space and business, is what I meant, sorry. Um, and he, he all of a sudden turns to me and just kind of goes, you know, I got beat up with a stick outside this Walmart once. I was like, okay, <laughs> kind of went back to mind my own business. And eventually he proceeded to go on about how he had fallen asleep at the wheel going 97 miles per hour. And he crashed his car and, like, cracked his skull open or something, and he could, like, see out the side of his skull. I don't know, it was really weird. But it's the weirdest thing. You meet the weirdest people in Walmarts. And, um, yeah, that's, that's Jacksonville for you. Well, it's not, I don't technically live in Jacksonville, but whatever. Um... So we've got a big chimney there, kind of warms things up. Wow, I got off track. Um, put a chandelier up there in the corner. And I wanted to put pillars to make it look like it was supporting the roof, but um, it didn't look right, the, the room wasn't big enough, and it just took up too much space, so I eventually get rid of them. So we go back to the cellar, and I build the giant beer kegs, or barrels, whatever you want to call them. And couldn't decide how I wanted to do the tap, so I just did a fence post. But yeah, Movie Maker. Um, it works, but it's a pain. If you're interested in doing something like this, it is a pain. Especially the new ones. Um... Yeah, if you try to add in a song, sometimes it's, it only adds in the first seven seconds for some reason. And um, so I went on Google and tried to figure out why this is. And tons of people, it sounds like, are having the same problems as I am. But there's not really any ways on how to fix it because it, it's just spazzing out. Um, and I guess I can't really get mad at it because it comes free with PCs, but it, it's still kind of annoying because I spent two three hours trying to make everything work today it was crazy um, I figured the if I did one big roof it would be too big of a building so I just kind of split it up in twos there and on the tavern there 
I thought it was interesting the way I did it, and it was just it was just something different. But uh, I'm not really sure how well I pulled that off. As far as I, I don't know, I just don't know how decent it is. I wanted to do a big bay window so you could step out in it and overlook the uh, the ship, but uh, from your hotel room. But it didn't work with the roof style and all that. It, it just looked weird, so I just put it inside there. It worked fine. And this is kind of the lounge rece reception area on the first floor here. Uh, well, second floor, first floor. I guess that's the basement in the tavern, so yeah, first floor. A little overhang there so you don't get wet when you're going into the tavern. Staircase up to the second floor with all the rooms. And up there, it also seems a little bit cluttered. Um, it's actually not as big a building as you would think, so it was kind of hard to fit it in there. I only had three rooms, and I made one of them like a big suite. But uh, other than that, it's really not that big a, a space up there. So I had a smaller room with one bed and then I had another room which is kind of the the poor people room I guess and you never know who you're bunking with because it's just a bunch of beds it's like five cents a night or something or other um, and then this is the big suite for the the uh, rich folk get their couch overlooking the ocean or the rest of the town rather it's not the ocean and then there's a coffee table some ferns just a nice way to fill in the room couldn't think of what else to do I guess I probably could have done a kitchen or a bathroom or something or other but oh well it's too dark so I added some windows with just fence posts and some decorations on the outside of the door. And these torches are really interesting because it's a torch and then you put an item frame behind it and then on the item frame you put a cobblestone wall and turn it sideways so it kind of looks like it's a holster for the, um, the, the torch. Anyways, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and or comment I'd really appreciate knowing what I'm doing right and what I'm doing wrong, and have a great day as we pan around our awesome new tavern. Join us next time and we'll build something else really cool. That's all for today, bye.